hey guys welcome back to my channel thank you guys for tuning in today today's video is a tutorial on how to make a frontal wig and if you haven't subscribed please do so by clicking the subscribe button below and join the family don't forget to like share comment it will really give me an idea of what you guys want to be seeing up on this channel okay yeah let's get into the video i wore the cap first making sure it's laid very very flat on my head just to measure the frontal on the cap before sewing it then use a pencil to mark where to sew the frontal that's why you're seeing all this white dot on the cap we used an office pin to pin down the frontal following the white dot at this point the frontal should lay down really flat After that, we just sew the frontal using a needle and a thread, removing the pins as we go. the frontal we'll start by sewing the longest bundle which is 22 inches and this hair is from hair spares we'll leave all the details in the description box so that you guys can go check them out the first bundle at the back will double the width because we really want the hair the wig to be very very full for the hand we are seeing in this video this is because we are also teaching our students how to make a frontal wig <laughs> We did the blanket stitching both on the frontal and the bundle so that the wig will lay very flat. When you get to the edge, you will need to do the folding over method. For this method, you open up the double track, sew the first weft and take the second weft down to the end, then turn it over and sew the both together. Don't know if that makes any sense, but watch the video very carefully. That this method is not for clients, it's merely for personal use. For clients, you do not want to use a pencil on the cap. You take proper measurement of the client's head using a measuring tape. this until you get to the top of the wig and sew in a curved line finally the wig is done take the wig off the mannequin and cut the excess cap from the frontal side <laughs> added an elastic band just to secure the cap so I turned the cap inside out just to apply some foundation on the frontal lace so that it will blend with my skin tone the 
cap on my head will use got to be glue to secure the front using my mini hand dryer to dry the glue before placing the frontal on my head <music> the baby hairs using got to be glue so yeah now it's time to flip the hair thanks so much for watching this video to the end subscribe if you haven't like comment and share we'll talk to you guys later bye